Hey guys, uh, I decided to make another one of the smoothies because uh, people seem to really like the smoothie recipes. This is another home chef. Now I have smoothies every day and I usually use my own ingredients, but one day a week I make home chef uh, smoothies and they send me all the products. I, I get their food subscription service, which I absolutely love. And smoothies are an add-on that you can get. So um, I do do one smoothie per week from Home Chef. And it's been great because it's really taught me different combinations and things that I never thought of to try. This one, for example. This is a strawberry malt smoothie with yogurt and oats. I never would have thought about putting um, malted milk powder in one of my smoothies. Uh, now this smoothie, it's 400 calories on the card right here you can see it tells you um, the number of calories so this is a meal for me and it has 23 grams of protein so I use these as meals um, but this is two servings and I don't need 800 calories so I split it in half one of um, my viewers asked that can you split them in half and I do that all the time I, I split them in half but what I normally do, which is easier for me, is I'll go ahead and blend it all together and put it in the fridge. And then tomorrow morning, when I want to make my next one, all I have to do is take that out and throw my ice in it, and then it's good to go. It just saves me a little time. So a lot of times I will just make everything. Okay, so this recipe, what they have sent with it, flip my little card over, they have sent... Uh, frozen strawberries, eight ounces of frozen whole strawberries. These are not frozen because uh, I just got this today. So these are not frozen, but it will be fine because I add ice to it anyway. 5.3 ounces of vanilla Greek yogurt. Then it's one teaspoon of vanilla extract. Two ounces of malted milk powder. That's, this is, that's what this is. It's malted milk powder. You can get this out of the cereal aisle in your um, grocery store and because I, I put this in like shakes and things all the time never thought about putting it in one of my smoothies but I don't know why um, <clears throat> and then it, then they also want you to add rolled oats it's uh, one and a half ounces of rolled oats sometimes when I make these recipes myself I just throw oatmeal in there seems to work fine and then uh, two speed two spe two tablespoons of sugar and eight ounces of almond milk and if I have almond milk I use it if I don't I use coconut milk or just two percent regular milk this recipe is very easy because all they're having me do is place all these ingredients into my blender all at the same time uh, with the my blender you put the liquids in first so I'm going to add the almond milk. And then I just kind of add them by what's most liquid. Throw in the strawberries. I guess you could probably make this with whatever you wanted. The vanilla extract. Now while you weren't looking, I added the packets of sugar. I did no reason for you to watch me open those. And I added the Greek yogurt, the container of Greek yogurt. I just need to pour in the malted milk and the rolled oats. That should be blended super well. And I'm going to pour out, you can look in there and see it. I'm going to pour out the part that I'm going to put in the fridge for tomorrow and then keep what I want to drink today in there and add the one cup of ice. I've added one cup of ice, so I'm going to blend it again. Here it is in my cup, and I tasted it, and it is absolutely delicious went ahead and cleaned my blender so tomorrow all I have to do is dump the smoothie in there throw in a cup of ice put it in a new cup and I have my smoothie to take to work with me thanks for watching bye